no girls who are trying to fit into the social norm like squeezing in the last year's prom dress. I know girls who are low rise, Mac eyeshadow, and binge drinking. I know girls that wonder if they're disaster and sexy enough to fit in. I know girls who are fleeing bombs from the mosques of their skin, playing Russian roulette with death. It's never easy to accept that our bodies are fallible and flawed. When do we draw the line? When the knife hits the skin, isn't it the same thing as purging because we're so obsessed with death? Some women just have more guts than others. The funny thing is women like us don't shoot. We swallow pills, still wanting to be beautiful at the morgue, still proceeding to put on makeup, still hoping that the mortician finds us sexy and attractive. We might as well be buried with our shoes and handbags and scarves. Girls, we flirt with death every time we etch a new tally mark into our skin. I know how to split my wrists to reveal a battlefield too, but the time has come for us to reclaim our bodies. Our bodies deserve more than to be war-torn and collateral, offering this as a pathetic means to say, I only know how to exist when I am wanted. Love your body the way your mother loved your baby feet. And brother, arm wrapping shoulders, and remember this is important. You are worth more than who you attract. You are worth more than a waistline. You are worth more than beer bottles displayed like drunken artifacts. You are worth more than any naked body could proclaim in the shadows. More than a man's whim or your father's mistake. You are no less valuable as a size 16 than a size 4. You are no less valuable as a 32A than a 36C. Your sexiness is defined by concentric circles within your wood. It is wisdom. You are a holy tree stump with the leaves sprouting out. I know I am because I said I am. I know I am because I said I am.